so in our thanks, we ought to give him some praise. Yeah, First Chronicles 16 and 9 says, Sing to him, sing praise to him, tell of all his wonderful acts. So don't get all bent out of shape because you don't want nobody to know where you come from. I get a joy out of telling folk where I come from. I ain't always been no preacher. But he looked beyond my faults and saw my knees and gave me another chance. Pick me up out the muck and my and place my feet on solid ground. Come on, talk to me here. All of us in here ask something. Come on, talk to me. And an ex whatever is just an ex. We can say this one of a credenza of the Bible. This 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 credenza uh, credenza is 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 a term in music. When the composer and the conductor wants the music to gradually get louder and louder and louder, the scripture is saying that we should sing praises to God for all of his wondrous works. Look, look, look what he's done. He brought us a mighty long way. Praise him for his goodness. Praise him for his mercy. Praise him for his grace. Praise him for his omnipotence. Praise him for his omniscience. Praise him for his omnipresence. Praise him because he's just been good. We also have the phrase of God in our spiritual warfare arsenal. See, see, the original Hebrew words for praise are hala and yada. Come on, talk to me here. Hala means to show or to boast or to celebrate and glory in him. Listen, I can glory in him. I don't need you to glory in him. Sometimes I'm riding in my car, Frank, and I just got to stop because tears is rolling down my cheek. They're not tears of sorrow. They're tears of joy. Look where he brought me from. Can I just share something with you? Every now and then I just reminisce from where he brought me from. See, you didn't pick no cotton. I did. I whipped almond trees. Come on, talk to me. I picked plums for $10 a day with a 25-foot ladder and a bucket on Die Giorgio Farms and had to catch a bus and ride an hour to get to where I had to work. And then when I got off in the evening, had to ride an hour back to, uh, to my house. But, uh, but, but making $60 a week, you ain't heard what I'm saying. I didn't deserve where he put me, but look where the Lord. Y'all ain't going to help me here. And you mean to tell me I can't praise him? Watch this, watch this. I got 35 grandchildren, 13 great-grandchildren. Didn't think I'd see Eric's children. Now they going out to the home coming. <laughs> Looked at my little grandson. He was sharp as a tick. My little granddaughter sharp. I didn't even think I'd get to see him. And God then left me around here. And I got great-grandchildren. Might have to be a great-great because I got some of them 15 and up. I'm just waiting on them to call me and tell me, you're great-great. You ain't hearing what I'm saying. But I thank God because he didn't have to leave me here. He didn't have to let me stay around. I'm not going to come in here and be hush-hush. This hala is the source of hallelujah, which is in the Hebrew expression of praise. I, I get excited when Pharaoh gets to talking about hallelujah, hallelujah, hallelujah. Some of y'all need to be saying hallelujah, hallelujah, praise the Lord. Sitting up in here. Some of you are going to be hollering at 2 o'clock when them Texans play Dallas at 12. I'm going to be in the pulpit preaching. Hallelujah! And 
And then yada, which means to give thanks and praise. A crazy praise. A hallelujah crazy praise. It is a verb that is important to the language of worship. It's found 120 times in the Old Testament. Quit talking about how bad things are. And do as the Bible said. Give thanks and praise. Ephesians 5 and 20 says, Giving thanks always for all things unto God and the Father in the name of our Lord Jesus Christ. Psalms 92 and 1 says, It is a good thing to give thanks unto the Lord and to sing praises unto thy name, O Most High. First Chronicles, I told you, 16 and 8 says, Give thanks unto the Lord, call upon his name, make known his deeds among the people. It ain't nothing wrong with to tell people what God has done for you. That ain't bragging. That's telling folk God is a good God. Look where he brought me from. Brought me out of a shotgun house. Put me in a house. Hell, there, God. Took me out. Come worship with us every Sunday morning at 8.30 a.m. at our North Campus and 12 noon at our South Campus.